So in this example, I have quarterly sales for a small business and I wanna be able to um, calculate the percentage of sales that is attributed to each quarter. So I might enter a formula that says, that says, I wanna take quarter one and divide it by the total sales. And I hit enter there and I see that it's 29.2%. And so I wanna uh, use that formula for the remaining cells, uh, the rest of the quarters. So I copy this and I paste it to the cells below. And I see that I'm getting a divide by zero error. And that's because the formula was copied using uh, relative addressing. So when I took the B3, B7 and moved it down a row, I get B4, B8. And so I want, the B3 to change to a B4, but I want the B7 to be used to divide all of the values for the quarters. So I'm gonna click undo here. And in this case, the way I can fix this is I can use what's called absolute addressing. So instead of um, using relative addressing for the total, I'm going to use, put dollar signs in that, uh, in that address and that will use absolute addressing, which means that when I copy it down the uh, column, it's going to, uh, the B7 is going to be maintained because the dollar signs are anchoring the column in the row and they're not in, in, are using absolute addressing instead of relative. So if I copy this, paste it, down the column. I can look at these cells. I can look and see that the dollar sign B, dollar sign seven remains the same all the way down. So that's called absolute addressing and we use it when we want to refer to a particular cell um, and we don't want that cell reference to change uh, when we move the formula to a new location.